All right, Neil, at the end of the 2010-2011 season, how do you gauge the Clippers right now? You know, we're look, we're a work in progress, but we started a rebuilding mode about, you know, a year and a half ago. Um, we kind of cleansed our roster of a lot of, you know, arduous contracts. And we're, I'd say we're deep in the fourth quarter of our rebuilding. You know, I think we're still one piece away. And, you know, it's our job right now to kind of focus between trades before the draft and then upcoming free agency to find that, that other piece to go with Eric and Blake and the rest of our core. Well, we're always, out, you know, you're always looking at the most talent as possible. And, uh, you know, we have a lot of flexibility with, with the, uh, the trade and things. So, um, you know, uh, Neil is being very active in, in discussions with uh, different teams. And, um, you know, we're just trying to find players that fit the culture, fit the nucleus uh, of what we've already built here. You know, I think we need a veteran leader. Um, you know, bringing Mo in was terrific. He's played a lot of playoff games. But I think we need another guy that's out on the floor consistently with Blake and Eric that can show those guys what it's like to play championship caliber basketball. And that's going to be the goal. We've got to find a guy that's got a roadmap for how you win championships. Because I think from a talent perspective, we've got multiple pieces that can win a title. We need to add more, but we need to have someone that knows how to get there. Well, professionalism, you know, knowing what your job is, um, having the right attitude, uh, being responsible not only on the court but off the court, be willing to be coached, um, and all those things. But the culture changes by winning, and uh, we have to do a better job and a more consistent job as a staff and as an organization in terms of that. So it's heading in the right direction. There's a lot of work to be done over the summer, and uh, the guys are in here working hard, which, which is a great sign. You've got a lot of the guys right now coming into the to the facility to work out. What does that say to you about the commitment of this team to improve and to, to do better? No, it's great. I mean, look, first of all, it's the facility. I mean, it's a great place to be. But, you know, it just shows. I mean, everything ended on a positive note. Guys were thrilled with the trade. They were thrilled with the roster composition. And, look, you know, having a motor, having a desire to get better at this game is one of the things we factor in when we draft players. And it's evident. I mean, we finished strong. At least we felt like we did. And the guys were dying to get back in the gym. So the fact that you see, you know, half of our team, team here right now and you know the veterans coming back they want to be a part of this and they they know they're building on something special and you know it's never too early to start and, and that's great for us for more on the clippers check out clippers.com and for ticket information call 866 4 clippers